We told you about the 14-year-old girl in Pakistan who stood up against the Taliban so that girls could go to school. They shot her in the head. She is still in critical condition. But this one young heroine has inspired a growing movement in Pakistan to unite against the Taliban and say, finally, enough is enough. Here's ABC's Mohammed Leela. At candlelit vigils, she's an icon of hope, a courageous young girl now fighting for her life in a military hospital. Malala can be anybody's child. It is not that this thing will stop at one person. 14-year-old Malala Yousafzai was shot and nearly killed on her school bus, targeted by the Taliban. Her only crime, demanding the right of girls to go to school, something the Taliban oppose. The attack has shaken the country from ordinary Pakistanis right to the highest levels of power. Even the head of the country's powerful army visited her in the hospital, saying we refuse to bow before terror. Farzana Abari fights for women's rights. We spoke to her with Malala's story on the front page of every newspaper in the country. How is it that a 14-year-old girl can capture the hearts of a country like this? Because I think she, she represents our dreams. She represents uh, what Pakistani majority of people uh, stand for. And tonight, as young Malala fights for her life, a nation of adults and children are going to bed praying for their new hero. Mohammed Leela, ABC News, Islamabad.